All right, I'm here with Coach Larry Wade, new strength and conditioning coach for Jake, the problem child. Paul, how you doing, Coach? Hey, man, I'm doing great, brother. Hey, man, you've been in camp with Badu Jack, Sean Porter, uh, Caleb Plant, yeah. MMA world champions, etc. What's it like working with Jake? Man, it's amazing. It's not what people think. This kid works his ass off, man. You know what? Um, you name a lot of world champions I work with, and and I've, I've had I think 14 world titles now. And this kid works as equally as hard, equally committed, and dedicated to being the best. The same way those guys would. I have to apply to young man because the work I do is not easy. And he gets it done. He doesn't complain one bit. So he's earned the position that he's at right now for sure. So, I mean, Jake is new to this boxing game, and, he, and he's knocking out guys that are legends in MMA. Yeah. Leg I mean, how, how surprising is that for you, or like even as a fan, that you could still get in a ring in front of millions of people and do what he's doing in a short time? Well, after I had a chance to get to know him, you know, it's, it's less surprising now that I've interacted with him because the guy has great power, great strength, great transitional strength. It's just a matter of getting him in there and getting experience. What, everybody, what the world has to, to see is they get a chance to see a guy who had no amateur experience come in the ring with guys who've been fighting their entire life, right? And he and he gets a chance to develop his skill set right in front of millions of people every day. That is not easy to do. And so you got to have a lot of courage and a lot of work that before, and he does have all of that. So knowing him a little bit more now makes it a little less surprising, but the kid is great. Now, as far as your routine as a coach, and, and, and it's well document, documented, is there anything different you're doing with Jake than you would with anybody else? Well, absolutely. you got to understand that when you're developing an athlete, you can't train them all the same. There's some guys who come in with 10 years of experience. There's a lot more you can do with that guy. Then you got a guy who has one-year experience. There's a lot less you can do with that guy. So when you get a guy, you have to evaluate him, figure out what he needs for the moment because you only have like 10 to 8 weeks to get a guy ready and then you work on those pieces. Luckily for me, Jake came into the camp with a pretty strong baseline of strength. So he can, he can bench, I think, 350 or more. You know, So I'm not really concerned about the baseline as much as more can we get him functionally ready for what he has to do, and he's done that. Coach, I'm here with Coach Larry Wade. What, what is his ceiling? <laughs> World champion. You know, he, uh, to be honest with you, that was one of the reasons why I decided to work with Jake. When I came in and he interviewed me, and he was telling me what he wanted to do. One of the first things he said is, there's two things he said specifically. Coach Wade, tell me the truth, don't lie to me. If I'm not doing well, you tell me I'm not doing well. He said, for me, that's easy, I'm gonna do that anyway. Then the second thing he said to me, I wanna be a world champion. When he said that initially, I took a step back. And he said he wanna be a world champion. I said, this guy telling me he wanna be a world champion? And then I thought to myself, why not? Let's go for it. And that made me even more excited to work with him because he wants to be a world champion, which means he will put forth his effort. And I don't, I've worked with a lot of them. So let's get to the bread, let's get to the wins, let's get to the belt, let's make it happen, baby. And that's why I'm in there. What should we expect Saturday night against UFC legend Nate Diaz, who, who loves the, the brawl? He did, you know, he, he's done it all in the UFC. Entertainment, you're gonna be excited. There's gonna be a lot of excitement in this fight. You're gonna see a lot of things. Nate's gonna have his moments. Jay's gonna have his moments. But at the end of the day, I see Jake knocking him out. I see Jake locking down. So one thing I learned about Jake, when he gets pushed against the wall and he, and he feel like he's cornered, he's gonna hit you with something real hard. And I feel like that's what's gonna happen. He says he can go 20 rounds if he had to. I believe him. <laughs> Cause he's just built like that mentally. He's a tough, not, and hopefully nobody senses this out. He's a tough ass kid, man. He's 26 years old, he's banging, he's tough. Mentally, he's a strong guy, so if he says 20, it's 20. Coach Larry Wade in Jake Paul's camp thank for his you. first time says he's going to knock out Nate Diaz this Saturday night. Thanks, Coach. Hey, thank you.